Hello everybody, welcome to this very exciting video. So today I'm going to be storing my photo cards. I don't know how many I have if I'm being honest. This is two months worth so I honestly don't even have that much. <laughs> but yeah, so today I'm going to be storing some photo cards which I'm pretty excited to finally do this because like I said it's been two months the last one I did was back in December so that's kind of crazy to me okay let's get started so I always start with ATs because I always have a million photo cards for them I will have timestamps available too so y'all can skip around if you just want to see specific groups but let's get started so I'm going to store some photo cards that I have for Outlaw still. I am not done with Outlaw. I am kind of behind with ATs I feel like. Normally I'm caught up for the eras but this time around or I guess last year I just was not in it. They did have a million photo cards though in my defense but I'm done with like all their album photo cards for Outlaw but I'm still missing Digipack photo cards so it looks like I have I think a few Digipack photo cards. So I have this Sungwa but it's the other one so it goes here. So for the digipacks, I actually decided to collect full group for just the yellow back ones. And then for pink back, I decided just to collect my bias line, which is half the members. So I should just honestly collect OT, but I don't want to commit to that quite yet. But yeah, so I'm still missing these three and then these two for the yellow back. And then for the pink back, so I was originally going to collect Sungwa, Yuno, and Wuyang, which those are like my top three. But I did pull both Mingi's, both of his pink ones. So I figured that I would just add him in here because he is actually my fourth bias, I guess. Okay, I think I have the pink ones up here. And then I'll put this on here. So it's still opposite, so it'll still go like Mingi in the corner, Sungwa in this corner, Yuno, and then Wuyang. So it still works out fine, but I just figured I would keep his photo cards instead of trying to trade or sell or whatever. So I'm still missing three of these, but that's not too bad. I was thinking about fully collecting the pink back ones too, like collecting OT8, but I think that would be way too much for my little bank account to be able to handle. So I'm just going to stick to this. And then I do have, I think, one platform photo card to store. And honestly, I don't even know where it goes. I think it's this one. Yes. I have Jungho's cute little photo card. So now I'm just missing two photo cards. I'm missing a Mingi one and a You Know photo card. I forgot, though, that I need to go back as you can see some of them have the ultra pro sleeves because i i don't know if you can tell because i ran out of dragon shield sleeves so i do need to re-sleeve like all of these ones <laughs> i need to re-sleeve a lot of photo cards for them which i kind of forgot about it's like half and half currently you can't even really tell until i turn the back and then you see the ultra pro little i don't know logo thing <laughs> But I think that's everything for Outlaw. I don't really like buying 80s photo cards. Like, I just want to trade for the ones I'm missing. I think I have a few photo cards to put here for Will Era. So it looks like I have a few album photo cards. So I have a, one of the version A photo cards, and it's someone's cute selfie one which goes here i'm kind of struggling trading for these photo cards i didn't think it would be this difficult to trade for 80s photo cards it's normally not difficult for me oh wait something <gasps> these ones aren't even in the middle wait let me fix that okay there we go i didn't think it would be this difficult to trade for their photo cards but it's been kind of difficult for me Okay, then here, I think I just have Sani's. I'm pretty sure it goes here. <laughs> so I have San's photo card. And then I think that's it for the diary version. And then for this one, oh no, did I trade for him twice? I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I have no idea what's happening there, but apparently I traded for Jungho twice without even realizing. But I do have Hongjin. This is such a chaotic video already. I apologize. That's so funny. How did I end up with two Jungho's? 
Okay, so it looks like I'm still missing this Yuno. And then here I have Jungho and Sun. I don't know if the group orders I joined, if I'll end up getting album photo cards. If I do, I'm just hoping that I get the ones that I'm still missing, obviously. That would be amazing. I honestly had no idea I was still missing Yuno for this. That's a little bit annoying. <laughs> I thought I was done with this set. Okay, looks like I'm not even done with any of the sets yet, which is a little insane. Okay, here, I think I traded for Hongjun, but I cannot remember. I seriously have no idea where that card is. Like, it hasn't arrived, and I feel like I traded for it a while ago, so hopefully it arrives sometime soon. Okay, then here are the other Digipack photo cards. And I'm pretty sure I have almost all the members. I got super lucky. If you watched my Digipack and Platform unboxing, I pulled seven out of the eight members for the Korean version of the Digipack photo card. So quite proud of myself for that. Okay, so put Hua here. Oh no. I hate when they move. These are so freaking cute too. I love these photo cards. I think I, I don't know. I kind of like these more than the other ones, I think. I really like the other ones too though, actually. I don't know. I like both sets of the Digipack photo cards. That is all I have. I have Sungwa. So if anybody has Jungho and wants to trade for Sungwa, please DM me. I keep cracking my knuckles. I'm so sorry. I'm like... <laughs> I don't know, I'm being weird. But okay, so that's all I have for that. So for the <laughs> platforms, I'm not gonna lie, I'm once again not doing well. I thought I would do better than I am now, but nope. For some reason, I'm still just procrastinating this. But for QR code photo cards, it looks like I have three of the members. I need to buy more platforms. I keep telling myself that I'm going to buy more platforms and then I just don't do it. Once again, hopefully the group orders I joined, I will get some platform photo cards. That would be amazing. Okay, then here for, the, oh, these are the standing photo cards. I think I have a few of those. So I have a few of the standing. I think these are the standing ones. So I have some uh, they're like, don't even know how to describe them, <laughs> but they're like the little cutouts because I think you can make them be like an actual standee situation. Woo Youngie. And then Mingi. So those are all of the platform standing photo cards I have. Next we have like the normal PC, which I think is just like the selfie photo cards where they're doing like the little cheek heart thingy. The thing with these freaking photo cards, though, the platform ones, I was debating on just buying the platform photo cards and not buying platforms or anything like that. Just the actual photo cards that I'm still missing. But y'all, it's freaking expensive just trying to buy platform photo cards these things should be like two dollars at most and no people are selling like each photo card for ten dollars i don't know why platform photo cards are always more expensive than album photo cards it just does not make sense because platforms literally cost ten dollars and they're pricing each photo card for ten dollars when it comes with like six or seven or something like that i don't know y'all okay then we have the image photo card which are these ones have a you know yeah so i think i am just gonna buy more platforms instead of photo cards i haven't checked makari japan though it might be cheaper on there to buy the missing photo cards okay then we have the polaroids so i don't have that many polaroids i only have four so i have some more for this version And then I have three for the Polaroid 2. Put him here. And I have little Yosan. 
I love the Hong Jun and the Wu Young one. Because he's like wearing glasses and then he's doing his iconic little like part from crazy form. That's what it looks like he's doing anyway. That is all I have for our album photo cards, which is actually quite a lot to be honest. I'm still missing, I mean, a ton of them. So you'll for sure still be seeing this binder. But I think this is the last era that's going to fit in here. Because as you can see, this binder is so full. This is a three inch binder. Look at how, how full this is already. That's kind of insane. So I think this will be the last era for this binder. So this will become a retired binder once I'm done collecting all those photo cards. Next, we have another binder that's really thick nowadays, and it is my AT's pre-order benefit slash fan sign photo card binder. Wow, that was kind of a mouthful for me. <laughs> but yeah, so I just have all the pods in here, so we're going to skip to Outlaw, I think. I'm probably going to have to do a lot of flipping back and forth because I did not organize my photo cards well, so <laughs> everything's just kind of a mess. But let's store away my, geez, I have a lot, some of my Uno you know photo cards first, because I have a few outlaw photo cards. What is this? Is this movement? Yeah, that's movement. <laughs> uh, this is a witness. Okay, here's outlaw. Is this outlaw? Okay, so this is where Outlaw begins, and you guys, I don't know how this happened, but I have a million Outlaw photo cards still. Like, how did this happen? I have no idea, and I just, this is a lot. It's so much for no reason at all, but I don't know. Do I have any of him looking soft? Actually, I do have... Oh, wait. This outfit, I'm pretty sure I have a... Yes, I do. So, it looks like I have this one. Hopefully, I have one more with him in that outfit. I don't think I do. Dang it. I could use, like, this one. It kind of would go with it. I think that's what I'm going to do. Let me... The way that I do it is based on, like, the back of the photo card. I think it'll look fine. Yeah, like that. So, that's how I'm going to do it. This one will go up top. Dang, if I find one more photo card of him in this outfit, I might just buy it. Or maybe I already joined like a group order for it, I don't know. But this one kind of sticks out a little bit, but it doesn't look the worst ever. I think this is where it started to be like random photo cards, so I put a bunch of random ones together. But this one looks good, I think. This one kind of looks out of it though. In my opinion. I know these ones kind of go together. Yeah, I don't know, y'all. I have a lot where he's blonde. He has brown hair. Let's see if I have any more of him with brown hair. These all look... Okay, I have these two. Oh, I have a lot more than I thought. Okay, because these are all like where he's blonde. I don't know, you guys. He changed up his hair <laughs> on me. Okay, I'm thinking about doing this one and this one. Ooh, that, I don't know. I don't really like any of these here. <laughs> I think, I don't mind this one. Wait, let me check the back once again. Yeah, that wouldn't look terrible up here. You know what? I truly think that this one would look better over here. So I'm going to leave that one there and then here hopefully there's one more of him in this outfit and like I said I'll just go ahead and buy it because uh, I don't think I have like any more group order things coming to me but let's see I think I do have two three more with his darker hair so I think what I'll do is get rid of this one because this one's just <laughs> flimsy and then add these ones here. So it looks like these are like white backs. So I'll put these two at the bottom. Put this one up here. And then I don't think these really matter. Oh my 
god, <laughs> this is actually really adorable. So there we have that page. Okay, so I do need one more nine pocket to add here. Should I do it based on the back? I mean, these three low-key kind of go together. I feel like these two kind of go together, like the backs of them do anyway. And then these two go together. And then in the middle, I could just do like these. That wouldn't be too bad. Let's see how this would look. I mean, doesn't look the worst ever. I kind of don't hate it, I don't think. I feel like this one might look better here. Okay, I'm gonna try this <laughs> and see if I hate it. So let's see how this looks on the back. Yeah, that's gonna bother me. Maybe I should just do this one. Or this one might look better down here. Wait. There we go. He's like making the same pose, kind of. He's just wearing different clothes. <laughs> Oh my gosh. But okay, yeah, that looks way better in my opinion. So I'm gonna leave that like that. Wait, should these be in this order? <laughs> Does it matter what order? I mean, probably not. I could just put my favorite in the middle, but I think it looks fine like that. So I'm just gonna leave it. And then, oh, I lied. I need one more <laughs> nine pocket. So I'm gonna put one more nine pocket for these photo cards i don't know if i'm getting any more outlaw photo cards i truly don't think there are any more group orders that i joined so i think this is going to be it so i might just maybe buy more we'll see what happens i'm just gonna put some blank fillers in here for now I don't really want to buy more photo cards, so that's why I'm like, eh. For our Will era, I've barely joined any group orders for Uno you know, because, y'all, it's hard out here trying to afford to collect Uno. You know. Yeah, this era for Will, there's not going to be as much for sure, but... So for Will, I have just a few of them, and it looks like they're basically the same outfits, kind of. Like, I think I'll add these up here. Wait, I guess I should see what colors they are on the back. Oh, it doesn't matter. But yeah, these are like all the Hello82 photo cards, pretty much. So I'm just going to add these here. And then I'm just going to add this random Uno you know, down here. This is the Walmart one, I remember that. <laughs> But yeah, so these are very similar, just holding different things. But yeah, these are all like Hello82 related photo cards. Okay, so it looks like I do have a set of photo cards, like an OT set, which I don't think I've really... Oh, I did collect quite a bit of OT sets. I'm lying. Oh my god, I'm still missing Barnes & Noble photo cards. What the heck? But yeah, so it looks like I did the US... The Hello 82 Distribution, Target, and then Barnes & Noble. And then I have one more OT set. So I'm going to add my fillers yeah, in the middle. So I have this one set, and I have no idea what store it is. I kind of forgot. Was this Soundwave or something? Or Apple Music, maybe? I don't know. I just bought an entire set of the Korean digipacks and it came with this set of photo cards. I bought it off of Sub K and it came with this set. So that was kind of nice. You know, getting another OT set. I will never say no to that. <laughs> yeah, they look so cute. I think I joined a group order though for that you know so I'm gonna have another you know but I'll just sell him I keep spitting oh my god <laughs> so that's it for there and then I have some random photo cards looks like they're outlaw photo cards I'm just gonna add these here I have four of them exactly 
I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. I might end up selling them later in life, but for now I'm just gonna keep the extra photo cards that I get because sometimes you have to join group orders and you have to buy like two in order to get another photo card of your bias. So that's what I've been doing. And so yeah, I just have some extra photo cards there. But yeah, this binder is getting full and I'm thinking that I'm gonna have to take Uno you know out or something. Maybe just have like an OT8 Pops binder and then a Uno you know binder. That might be the move. <laughs> this is the AT's merch binder and I have actually quite a bit of merch photo cards to store. Don't know how that happened. I feel like things just keep accumulating out of nowhere. But I'm gonna be doing a lot of flipping back and forth. Let's do an a teeny room part. Cause I have an a teeny room photo card to store and it's Wu Young's. So I figured we could do that right now. Um let's see. Right here. Wu Youngy. I think it's this one. I mean it would have to be this one, right? So I have that one and then I have a Wu Young birthday merch photo card to store because it was his birthday recently in November. It wasn't even that recent. <laughs> but yeah, so I do have this Wu Young -y. So I think I'll just put it here. And then once I get you knows his will go there or something. Or I could. Uh, I don't know kind of want it in order because this was the very first one this was the second one this is the third year but whatever i'm just gonna do it like this oh that's so cute <laughs> okay so that's it for like random photo cards now we'll do like the random sets that i have so i have season's greetings photo cards to store so this was last year's season's greetings i think yes yeah, because they did the two sets. They did like a prom version and then I think this is called like the friends version. So I'll add two more nine pockets. Normally I add the nine pockets the day before, but sometimes I just don't have the time <laughs> or the energy really. So I'm like, let me just film me actually adding that in there. Here are the two sets that I have. So it looks like for the first year I did like the suit concept first and then I did like the cute concept second so I think I'm gonna do the same thing this time around and put like the darker concept I guess it's not really darker but you know well I guess technically they're all wearing black <laughs> yeah so I'll do this concept first they look so cute I actually really like both sets now that I have both sets I can't really choose a favorite at first I really liked the this concept but after having both of them it made me realize that this set is really cute too so now i'm just like good thing i joined that group order so that i could get both sets then we have one more for the cute concept this you know oh my god it's so cute And then add the filler thing. Alrighty, so there we have the cute season's greetings. I think I'm gonna try to do this in order now. So done with season's greetings. This was their 18 kit thingies, and we have their online concert thingy, DVD photo cards, 18 room. Um, Snowman Factory. Oh, wait, okay, so we have Snowman Factory. And then we have, like, these Valentine photo cards that they did. And then they decided to do Christmas photo cards this year. So I'm just gonna add, once again, another nine pocket for these really cute Christmas photo cards. They're literally just wearing these, like, red, I don't even know, Santa capes. <laughs> they look so adorable, though so freaking cute so i did like these so i don't know if you can tell but they're like these little snowflake thingies and because it's like christmas time i think i'm going to do another one of those because i do have like a whole pack of these so whenever it's like wintery themed i like to add 
the snowflake one. I think it just makes it look cute. You can't really tell on camera though. Like you can't see it well, but in person it looks so freaking cute. Okay, but yeah. So there we have it. Let me see what other photo cards I have. So it looks like I have the Nasific photo cards that they did. And then I also have these like random, I think these are like merch drop photo cards. And I think these should go first because I did collect some Murnau photo cards. And so here I will add the Nasific collab photo cards. I'll just put all the photo cards here. These are so pretty. I freaking love these photo cards so much. They just announced or re no, I think they announced it. I don't think they released it yet, but their next Nasific drop, and I think it's just IDs, like little I, you know, those ID thingies <laughs> instead of photo cards. So I'm kind of happy about that. Or I joined a group order just for you know. Then we have like the random merch. So they did like this fellowship of the end merch thingy. And I only got those photo cards. So I think this is where I'm going to add them. Because then it goes to sub K merch drop. I think I'll add it here. I think it would make the most sense. I try to have it organized by like the specific like where I get the photo cards you know what I mean because some are from dvds season's greetings and all of that and then some of them are just like merch like random merch that they release and so I think this was tour merch possibly it came in like that tin case thingy so that's what these are so I'm just gonna put them after their other tour merch thing that they've done <laughs> And I think that's it, <laughs> finally. So now we're done with all of 80s photo cards. Now we can move on to, I think I'll do Monster X. I just have their season's greeting photo cards to store away. So I'll do that next. This is the Monster X binder. <laughs> this one's also full. All my binders are getting so full, but for them, like I get kind of a little break. Oh my God, I'm really behind on their solo photo cards. Like I don't even know if I want to collect them now because it makes me scared of how much I'm still missing but oh I think this was their last year one yes wow I flipped almost right to the spot I needed to be I need three nine pockets for them because they gave us two sets of photo cards but then they also I think it's just two sets and then they also gave us a set of IDs so I'll do I think I'll do the photo cards first so it goes show new. Oh, y'all, I love Monster X size photo cards. I just love that they fit perfectly here. Okay. Then I'm gonna need actually quite a few of these. Once again, this is normally something I would do off camera, like making sure my fillers are all set, but I feel like lately I haven't been doing that. I've been kind of busy. Oh my god, they look so cute! <laughs> Sorry, I just, I love Monster X so much. So let's do the other one. <laughs> And like, look at the little drawings. Wait, I think, okay, yeah, I do put the drawing photo cards first. Just making sure. There we have the second set, which is also so cute. Okay, then lastly, we have the ID photo card set. 
And I actually need to get my white sleeves out so that I can use those as my fillers instead of using my paper stock thing. What is it called? Construction paper? <laughs> I don't know. Card stock. So I like to use my Dragon Shield sleeves so that it doesn't get too bulky. There we have the ID set and then I actually got these two photo cards. I think they're honestly I don't know what store they are but they're pre-order benefits for getting these season's greetings and I did pull Kihyun so that was pretty exciting. I'm just gonna put them here in like my random section area thing so I'll just put these two here. <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> okay, so yeah, there we have that. Now we can move on. I think I'll do Extinary Heroes next because I have some more merch photo cards for them. I don't have their album photo cards yet, which is kind of insane. They're probably going to announce a comeback soon, and I don't have any of their album PCs yet. <laughs> this is my Extinary Heroes binder, and let's store some photo cards. So I do have one album photo card to store right now gosh and it's don't even know where it goes honestly i think i'm gonna put it here wait here it probably doesn't really matter where exactly but i think it looks good there now i have some merch photo cards to store and i think i keep those back here Yes. Okay, I actually grabbed four just in case because I think I have more photo cards than what I originally thought. But I have their photo cards for their little accessory. They have an accessory for their light stick and it's like these little double horns and it's so cute. <laughs> so I did buy that and it came with a full set of photo cards which is so nice. Honestly, you guys, I'm still waiting. I'm waiting for them to announce their tour dates for America. Like, what's happening? I don't know. It's so weird that they announced, like, a 2024 tour and then they didn't announce any dates. Like, they literally announced that last year. And they have not even announced any of the dates. Like, none. Like, what even is happening over there in JYP? I have quite a bit of merch photo cards to store because I had like this one little booklet thingy that came with a calendar and it also came with a lot of photo cards which was nice. So on this page I'll just do 1 through 6 and then the next page will be 7 through 12. These photo cards are so cute. Even though they are the concept type of photo cards I still think they're really cute. So now we can do the second set, which I think they're a little bit further away. Yeah, I'm sorry. These are just adorable. They look like they should be in the Outsiders movie, but not because it's a sad movie. <laughs> Dang, I'm actually going to be running out of time, so I might have to stop after this. Eight days just took me so long for no reason. AT's always takes me so long, but I've been filming for about an hour already, and I have to go somewhere today, like right now. Once I'm done with Extinary Heroes, I think I will just take a little break, and then I'll come back and hopefully finish filming. <laughs> if it's a different day, then I apologize, because I feel like that kind of messes with everything, because the sound and visually, it just kind of looks different, but... Okay, then these are from like the random photo card pack that I got and then these are the like JYP pops that I pulled. I think this is how I'm gonna do it. So I'll put these three up here. 
the pre-order benefits. I don't really want to trade or deal with any of that stuff, so I'm just going to do it this way. We would go here. I'm just going to do an eight pattern real quick. There we go. I mean, it kind of looks a little weird, but it doesn't look the worst ever. So, yep. Oh my god, I didn't even notice that this one was orange. Should I switch these? No, I'm just gonna leave them. Nope, that's gonna bother me. Okay, let me switch this real quick. Okay, I think... There we go, that looks better. Okay, so that's all I have for Extinary Heroes. I don't know who to do next. Oh, I'll probably do Boy Next Door next. Hello, y'all. So... I lied to you guys, it's actually a completely <laughs> different day. I just did not have time whenever, I don't even remember what day I was filming, but we're moving on to Boy Next Door now. I'm going in all order, so I did AT's Monster X and Extinary Heroes, and so next would be Boy Next Door, and I truly do not have that many photo cards to store for them. This part shouldn't take too long, but... I just have a few from the most recent era because right here I think I have a cute little Lunhak photo card and I'm pretty sure it goes right here yes oh my god it's so cute wait this isn't even centered so sorry I'm actually done with them the other photo cards i think they just arrived but so they didn't make it in time for this video but they'll for sure be complete by the next storing photo cards video and then i have this one's on the way i have this ryu and tesan photo card oh my god <laughs> this is adorable so i'm just missing the jaehyun and lehan which like i said it's on the way and then I think I'm still missing some of their pre-order. Yeah, or not pre-order, but like special photo cards. So I'm still missing Jaehyun's Target and Lehan's Target photo card. That's not really like a worry. Like I'm not even <laughs> trying to buy those right now because these Target photo cards are super expensive. But I do have an OT set to put away. So I just keep some Ryu pre-order benefits in the back that I have. But I have one set to put away it's actually their season's greetings photo card set these are from their season's greetings they're so cute i did buy their season's greetings i just had to do it especially because it's like their first season's greetings oh my god i'm so excited because apparently they're gonna have a comeback in april which I'm hoping they don't just do three songs. I'm hoping for at least five songs on this album because I don't know, y'all. I need more than just three songs. So there we have the really adorable set. And I use my sparkly sleeves for this. Also, I've gotten comments or people have said that they like when I unbox their albums and like the intro because I always do the knock and I'm like, who's their boy next door, you know, which is their intro. I just like have to do that now for the rest of boy next door being together because it's just too iconic. I love, absolutely love their greeting like the knock and then who's there boy next door like come on <laughs> that's just genius in my opinion but also like their name like boy next door i think is a very cute and fitting for them too so ugh, i just love boy next door i don't know if you all could tell i mean i altered them pretty quickly so i think maybe you can tell okay next i'm going to do p1 harmony i think Okay, so for P1, I only have one photo card to store right now because I'm not storing any of their new photo cards, which are probably like, what the heck, bestie? Like, you already filmed your unboxing. But I just need to, like, organize that. Plus, I haven't even set up for their uh, last era that they just did, or that they're still in, technically, the Killing It era. So I just need to get my life together a little bit, and then I will store them. 
Okay, where is it? Right here. I finally have this, y'all. Somebody gifted me Jungsook's ID, and this was the very last one that I was missing. Wait, it looks like I have it the opposite way. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, this is the very last photo card I needed. So now I'm technically caught up, except for killing it because it's currently happening like that era is but ah and they also got their first music show win which was so exciting i love killing it like a lot so i was so excited for them y'all <laughs> okay so that's like the only photo card for this so now we'll do we i next so here is my we i binder it is super packed i collect ot but i don't think i'm going to for their next era for their next era i plan on only collecting Donghan. Which I know that's pretty sad, but I don't know, y'all. I just cannot afford to fully collect them. I thought I could do it, but I just can't. Looks like I only have one photo card for them, too. <laughs> so I just have this random, I think it's a platform photo card. Oh, no. And I don't even, it's probably in the way back. And I don't remember how I set this up, too. So this is going to be so fun for me. Okay, so it looks like I have... Their QR platforms here. QR1. QR1. Here. I'm assuming this goes here. I might rearrange this later in life. I'm like really behind on their photo cards too, which is kind of overwhelming. So that's why I decided for the next era to only collect Donghan, who's my bias. I was going to do my top three, but I legit, I think I can only do Donghan at this point. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm almost caught up with like the other eras, but if y'all have any extra Wii photo cards and are selling them, like I will buy them from you because I want to be done with them or caught up at least. Then maybe I'll think about still collecting OT6, but I don't know you guys. I just am collecting too many groups at this point. It's a little bit overwhelming. He was really crooked, so I had to fix him. So that's it for this binder. Next, we'll do psychers because I have a few photo cards to store for psychers. They're not even an all of mine, and I collect also way, way too much for them. Like, this binder is already getting full, and it's only been two eras. Like, what the heck? So I have this one Yechun pre-order benefit not a pre-order i think it's just a u.s card it's the barnes and noble card oh my god my hands are so dry i always forget to put on lotion before filming i should just be putting lotion on regardless but anyway okay so i have ye chan because i decided for some dumb reason to collect ot i think i was just really excited for their debut so i was like let me collect him or all of them i should say for Barnes and Noble and Barnes and Noble is like the most expensive US photo card out there because Barnes and Noble they raise their prices a lot like their prices are pretty ridiculous but whatever so I collected OT and I'm finally done and then I have a few Hyunwoo pre-order benefits I'm still fully not fully collecting but I'm still collecting a lot of Hyunwoo's pre-order benefits I honestly think I find him the most fun to collect pre-order benefit wise. I feel like I only do him and then I do Extinary Hero Jungsu a little bit too and then you know from 80s but I honestly I think my favorite to collect is Hyunwoo. I just think not only are they adorable but like I don't know there's just something about collecting Hyunwoo that just melts my heart. I just find him adorable so he's my child. <laughs> Okay, but I have some from the most recent era. Oh, I do not like how this binder is set up at all. Wait, what is this? <laughs> oh, the Amazon one? Sorry, I'm like kind of confused on what's happening here. Looks like I'm just missing Hyunwoo, which is weird. Okay, then. <laughs> so I have one where he's wearing like his jean jacket, which technically matches these two. I'm gonna see if this can go somewhere else though. Dang, these are like all packed already. Oh, I do have this extra page, so I could put these all just here for now or something. But I wanna see if it'll match other ones a little bit better. Oh, I think I did it based on the backs. Like the backs for this one are really cute. 
the bags for this one match. Okay, I think that's kind of what I based it off of was the backs. So for this, I'm going to turn it around and look at the backs. Oh, this one actually might look good there. This is a Polaroid. Oh, this one's double-sided. Never mind. Double-sided outwins the Polaroid. Then maybe something like this. And then hopefully I get one more pre-order benefit of his. That would be nice. Wait, let me put this in order. I don't know if the fronts will look good, but whatever at this point. This is his Barnes & Noble photo card. It was so difficult to find, but then I finally found it for a decent price. So that was pretty exciting. This one is so freaking cute. Like the little like peekaboo moment. Oh my gosh, it melts my heart. <laughs> Can you guys tell that I have like the biggest soft spot for him? Me? I'm like, they're not even an all and I collect this much. Maybe Hyunwoo's an all of mine. Like, I don't know, y'all. I've been feeling something, I guess. Okay, I'm actually gonna reorganize this super quickly because it bothers me how it's set up. So I'm gonna put all the OT sets here. So I think I have maybe a few more OT sets. Oh no, this is just a random set that I decided Oh no, th that is an OT set. Okay, it's these two. I love this page so much. Look at this. Isn't this stunning? I'm really proud of this page. This one and this one. Although, like, I wish there were two of him wearing this. Watch me find them. I will buy them if I find ones of him wearing that. <laughs> okay. okay, so let me put this up here real quick. Because I have, like, my OT sets. So then here would go this OT set. And then I have like random sets, as you can see. I am thinking about kind of downsizing this though. So I might do that. Oh my God, I have so much. And then this is for the most recent era. So I'm doing it based off of era. So it'll go like all the OT sets. And then here will be like the ones where I collected a little bit more. Oh, more members, I should say. Same with that one. And then this is for the following era. I'm just missing Hanu's freaking Amazon card. I need to try to buy that ASAP. And then these are kind of just there for group order that I joined when they debuted. I joined quite a few from this one specific Om who obviously, as you can see, I haven't received my things supposedly they'll arrive someday but I don't know but yeah I think I'm gonna do a downsizing video here soon so I will downsize what I want for psychers it'll just probably be pre-order benefits though because I have like too many of other members that I don't really need so I'll probably do that next we're gonna quickly do my victim binder or go through my victim binder they're the only group that I'm pretty sure yeah they're in an Avery binder but I don't mind them being in an Avery binder and not Office Depot, but I could switch them soon to the Office Depot one. But anyway, do I even have a cover? I don't have a cover for them. What is wrong with me? Okay, so I do have Sejun's Time of Sorrow photo card. So I'll put that here. Oh god, I'm like getting sad looking at this, y'all. I will use this binder if... Sejun does any solo releases. I'll just like put them in the back. Okay, then we have these two. So it looks like I have a purple Sejun. Purple back Sejun, I should say. So I'll put that there. So I'm just missing this one photo card now. And then I have one Byungchan photo card. Wait a minute. Did he have more selfie photos? I'm so confused. I am genuinely so confused. Was this supposed to go somewhere else? Group, group. Does this go like here? <laughs> I have no idea. Y'all, I'm confused. Does Byungchan just have more selfie photo cards? I'm gonna put it here because I have no idea if it's supposed to go there but it looks like it possibly does so i'm just gonna put my one random byungchan photo card right there it looks like i'm still missing a lot of group cards 
but yeah that's all i have because i'm caught up on like the most recent eras and then the rest is like period of benefits and seasons greetings oh god i still have that i could downsize this a little bit too i'm seeing like three photo cards that i don't really want or necessarily need i think we should do bts next i also need to make a new cover for them because this is not it <laughs> this is not it but I have a few solo photo cards to store. I might, though, need to look at my template for BTS. <laughs> I just recently put them in a white binder, too. That was kind of fun and exciting. I have all of their, like, group things in the front. And then here's where I have all their solos. So here is Hobies. It looks like these two are the Hope Edition random which I think is, are these ones. However, I do have this and I think it says target card. Maybe what I'll do is put, like move that, put his target card up here. It looks like I have these two. I'm just putting them in the order that they are in the template. I didn't know if I was going to get his target card or not, so that's why I didn't make a part, like a section for that. And then I'll put this here. And then I'll put this here. Oh god, I keep- I'm so sorry. I'm never centered anymore. <laughs> I keep forgetting to check. But yeah, I don't think this will look horrible. I could put this in the middle, but I don't know. I kind of- like having these two right there next to each other. So that's all I have for Hobie. And then I do have some Taeyong photo cards. I did not label all of them just because he has so many. So this one's the green and blue, but I'm only doing four and four. And I'm pretty sure the green and blue versions are the ones that I have. Yes, they are. So I guess I could just take these all out. These are so adorable. I think I want to put the dog ones like here. I guess I should see which one I want to put on the other page. So I'm going to put these two here. I already took that out. <laughs> okay, so these two here. So the one where it looks like he has kind of looks like a beach background. I think that's what I'm going to put on the other page. And then we'll do the blue versions here. I think it's this one which I could do it based off of like the version or like the name on the back but I don't care too much about that this one here this one here and this one here I don't know I guess it doesn't matter too much and then it looks like this one says purple and the weavers and I don't have that and then this says one of each color so it'll go blue up top oh god which one was blue oh no green up top wait did i do this right <laughs> yes okay so it'd be this one up top and then this one actually i forgot that i have to redo this so i'm gonna do green and then let me put this here i have the weavers or not the weavers i think it's the target card and I'm going to put that on this page, so that's why I'm changing this up. So this would go here. Because there's five photo cards instead of four. So this is his target card. It's because it looks so similar to these two, that's why I decided to have these two be on this page. And then this would go here. Okay. There we go. So that's how this will end up looking. And then I'm pretty sure there are two more that look very identical to these ones. I'm just going to buy his photo cards. I don't really want to trade for them just because they're pretty inexpensive to buy, like in sets on Mercari US. So that's what I plan on doing. The green, the blue version, and then his target card. 
And then here will be the purple version, and then this one will be the weaver's version. Wow, that was so difficult for no reason. Then we have Jungkook. So let me see his photo cards. Once again, I have a Target card. So I bought all of BTS's albums at Target. So that's why I have them. But it looks like I have... This one's PC1. However, this I'm going to do an 8 pattern as well because of that Target card. Which, where should I put the Target card? Maybe I should put the Target card in this corner? Oh no, it would be a 7 pattern. Let me switch this out. Oh my god, that actually makes sense because he has a song called 7. So like the fact that this is going to be a 7 pattern is just amazing. So then... I'll put his whatever this is in here. <laughs> what is this called? Just like his regular album random photo card. And then this, I'm going to put the target one in the middle. And then it looks like I have PC3. Wait, two PC3. And then PC4, and then the Weavers. Okay, so yeah, looks like that's what I have for Jungkook and his solo album. Not too bad, honestly. I'm only missing four photo cards, and this wasn't even planned. Obviously, I'm going to keep his target card. <gasps> oh my god, I didn't know about the bags. <gasps> ah, it's so pretty. I love this color. <laughs> okay, so that's all I have for this binder. Okay, next we have my ginormous three inch binder. I haven't even labeled it. I still have the Office Depot little sticker thingy on it, but this binder has a bunch of groups in it. So that's why I moved them to this three inch binder. And then I put BTS in a two inch binder just because it made more sense. But I do have TXT here and I only have two TXT or three. I have three TXT photo cards to put away. And y'all, I need to speed this up because they're also going to have a comeback. Of course they are. I'm so excited. I am genuinely excited, but like really, mm, I don't know. I'm scared. I have this Weaver's A2 photo card, which would be this one. And then I have his other Weaver's photo card. And his group photo card. Oh my gosh. Adorable. So I'm missing only Yeonjun and Subin PCs now. I'm completely done with Taehyung, which was kind of the goal since he is my bias. And I worry about him a little more. However, these two are very expensive members. So I am even more worried now that like the era is over and they're about to begin a new one. But... I will worry about that some other time. <laughs> and I do have some Jisung photo cards. So I collect Jisung from NCT Dream. Oh no, do I know what's what? I do not. I have no idea. I feel like this might be his poster version though. I think this is his introvert photo card. This seems kind of right to me. Just based on the backs alone because... Yeah, this one's like in this weird corner. Oh my god, so now I'm done with Jisung. I've been done with Jisung, I just haven't stored the photo cards. But look at how cute these are. So this was from ISTJ. And then up here is Candy. Yeah. And then we have Glitch Mode and Beatbox. So that's all I've ever collected for him. I don't plan on back collecting. But I do still plan on continuing to just collect Jisung. I used to collect OT for the digipacks, but now they do poster versions, and I hate poster versions, to be honest. If I were to collect anything, it'd be the S-minis, but I'm not, I don't plan on doing that. Look, I could downsize, too. Like, I have some random Jisung pods that I really don't need. Then we have Rise, which I've been done with. Okay, then we have ZB1, which I do have a few photo cards to store for them. So I have some of the digipack photo cards i have both of rookie's digipack photo cards so it looks like it's the lighter concept up top the darker concept here and then i also have both of the nukes as well wait 
is it these two? I think it's these two. I think these are the Digipack photo cards. Yeah, so it looks like that matches. Oh my god, look at the pre-order benefits I have. They're adorable, okay? kind of want to have like three per era. That would be kind of cute, but I don't care too much. Okay, then we have these two. Do I know where they go? Absolutely not. I'm assuming these are the mystery version photo cards. So I'm going to put them here. He's actually a, a lot easier to collect than what I thought. Oh my god, these are such cute photo cards too. <laughs> I don't think it really matters the order that I put them in. No. But yeah, so that is all I have for this binder. I don't know if there's... Oh, there are other groups in here. I forgot I have Evening. Or Even. Even. My bad. I keep wanting to say Evening. Just because that's kind of how it looks like written. But anyway... So I do have their photo cards. I don't know if I'm going to continue to collect them though. I loved their most recent comeback, you guys. I listen to Ugly nonstop, okay? However, I do not have the money to collect them. I could just buy like my bias. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. I might just be happy and content with this and just not collect them. Oh crap, I'm actually adding a new group to this binder. This binder is kind of a mess. I need to buy a binder specifically for this group. I just haven't had time to do that. Not too sure how many of these I need. Nine pockets. So I just grabbed three, but I might need more. So I'm collecting a girl group. I know this is my random boy group binder and I'm putting a girl group in here, but I'm collecting Kiss of Life. So I have Kiss of Life's born to be photo cards these are just the album photo cards i think they did either like platform or polka version of the album as well i don't think i'm going to collect those photo cards there's just too many and it's too much for me right now so i decided just to collect their album photo cards i do want their first album photo cards but haven't gotten there yet you know i just bought their born to be which is their most recent album and yeah, so I'm just going to store these in here and I'm going to do a four pattern or eight pattern technically and just put a cute little filler in the middle. I'm so excited to go like them. Look at how cute they are. I tried to match by their outfits. I think that's what I based this off of. So I'm going to do this in the opposite order where like they're in the corners, you know, or like opposite of each other. So then Julie's photo card will go here. Yeah, so it'll just be opposite, you know. I freaking love Kiss of Life so much. I was actually watching a few of their videos today. So this is just perfect. Me storing their photo cards right now. And the next page, I might not even need this many. Oh yeah, I think three is actually the exact number that I needed. Oh my god, they look so pretty. <laughs> I just love these photo cards. Look at Belle. Oh my god. Guys, I'm obsessed with them. Just absolutely adore them. Put that here. Then doing it mirrored. Also, didn't they just win an award, like Rookie of the Year or something like that? Which is pretty insane for like a non-big, what is it called? Like a non-big four group. Like that's pretty crazy to me. And then we'll do these ones. I don't even know which set is my favorite. I really love all of them <laughs> so much. They just look so pretty. Can y'all believe I'm collecting a girl group? I knew no one was expecting it. I didn't want to make like a huge announcement on it. So I just announced it in my open mail with me while I was opening my Kiss of Life mail. But yeah. And some of y'all were like, that makes total sense. 
because I forgot what they said. They were like, oh, I was gonna guess like Glaceraphim or something like that, but kind of had a feeling it was gonna be Kiss of Life just because they seem more your vibe. And I was just like, seriously, they are more my vibe for sure. Yeah, look at how pretty. I love this set. Like, I don't know what it is. I just think they look so gorgeous. I love it. Okay, so yeah, I think that is the end of this video. Hopefully it wasn't too, too long. And I hope you guys enjoyed me finally storing my two months worth of photo cards, which honestly, I didn't even have that many. And I don't know if I'm going to be doing these monthly anymore because I feel like I'm not buying as many photo cards or collecting as much. And once again, I do plan on doing a downsizing video. So look forward to that. But yes, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, like and subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you guys in the next one.